What's going on everyone? My name is Shady2247. Actually, no, it's not. It's just Shady. Haha, <laughs> I tricked you. Anyways, <laughs> um, so we're back in Dream. And, um, yeah, I got, I did play a little bit. I tried to record yesterday for this thing and found out that one of my recorders wasn't working because of the fact that I went t uh, to Windows 10. I did get the free upgrade and, and I actually did fix it, so it's actually working now. No idea what happened or anything like that. So, yeah, we're gonna try this again and see what happens. Yeah, yeah. One of my recorders was working, so I went through a whole, pretty much a whole ten to twenty minutes or something like that of recording this episode, and it did not record it. So I don't know how far I got in this thing. Uh, when I go back to sleep in this thing, I don't know how what point it's gonna bring me back to. So. Um, I just hope it brings me back to where I stopped the video at. Well, let's see what sleep shows me tonight. Yeah. Yeah, so I, I upgraded to Windows 10, and so far no complaints other than my recorder not working correctly, and I'm kind of mad about that. Um, thankfully, all I had to do was just uninstall and reinstall it again. That's it. So... Um, we're gonna Always get into this. That same dream. Always. So well, yeah, last time, last time this one actually appeared in front of me. Soul appraisal. So we're gonna get into this, see where it takes me. Hopefully, it just takes me to the beginning of this thing, not the point where I was at. No, because you guys missed the whole thing. Okay, so it did take me back to where I was. This is the beginning right here. And I do apologize, I'm just probably gonna have to get through this thing to get to the point where I was. They say to say all these bath most of these bathrooms are empty. Okay. There's maybe one somewhere around here that has something in it, so Oh yeah, that's right. I almost forgot to show you guys this. A solo reception. Typical. So, Dr. Brown has once again lost it. He keeps rambling, rambling on about time travel. In order to protect ourselves, we have secured his login and seized his experiment. His password is now blank blah blah blah. Do not release this information. So I have that password and login right here lo uh, written down. So. That was from the previous thing. So, it's over here. I didn't even look at this. Oh, it's just a prayer. Okay, so, yeah, there's really nothing here. So, we're gonna go upstairs. And these pipes are everywhere. It appears I can't go that way. I know in one of these bathrooms there's something in it, but I don't know exactly what it is. I do want to get back to where I was, so I'm just gonna kind of quickly look through here because I know there's some stuff in some of these things. <coughs> Today, we're going to be looking at streamlining our business space and social development and investing in new ways to research methodologies for bullshitting clients. <laughs> yeah, you said that before, that was part of it. Oh, that's funny. Oh, she's doing all in my way and stuff. Oh, wait, did I? I went down this way already. What am I thinking? Okay, this is the meeting hall or whatever this place is. Presentation room. I think after 
because I remember, I remember, um, itchy in my ear. Anyways, uh, I remember in yesterday's recording that I did, there was actually one of those, 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 uh, strips of paper right here somewhere on the stairs saying something about stairs leading, is uh, a sign of something and all that stuff. Um, but unfortunately I don't remember what it said, so... I think I, I, it's already, they all got collected already, unfortunately, so I have to, I'm just probably going to head up back, head up to the, where I was. So, yeah, I'm just going to head up to where I was. What's with all these pipes? I bet the plumbing in this place is a nightmare. Oh, uh, I can't open the thing. Oh, there, I was about to say. Okay, so we're going to go to three. Elevator music. I did not take the elevator last time. I went up straight up the stairs. Okay, so this is the way I needed to go. Wait, what does it say? Tubular assemblage. I can't go that way, so I'm going to go around. Wait, I don't remember this. This is different. Wait, what? I couldn't open that door. This is new. I, I didn't go through here before. Wait, what? I don't want to go through there yet, because I think that's the exit. Yeah, that's the exit. Okay, so I need to go back. I missed something somewhere. Oh, another page. Okay. Storage. To dream of storage units can relate to issue that you ha issues that you have or you are keeping to yourself instead of confronting. Items kept in storage may symbolize your past, or could be things that are holding back. Cluttered, uh, cluttered storage. To dream of clutter can represent a cluttered mind such as letting troubles build up instead of resolving them early on. Writing thoughts down on paper could help you organize your mind. It's true, I've done that. Really organize that. For some reason I still can't go through this door. Anyways, I need to go back because I think I missed some things. This is the way I needed to go. I don't know why, but it's actually pretty relaxing in here. I don't know why either. You're weird. Definitely weird. Okay, so this is the where I was before. Boxes were in my way, and I still can't get through. Don't know why. I mean, there's enough space here for me to get through and all that, so I don't know. Anything about that. So if I miss something there, I don't know. I don't care. Um, I am deeply sorry for that. Wait a minute. Wait a goddamn minute. What up? What? What? Did I miss something? Because I could swore that there was a computer in one of these, not stalls, but uh, in somewhere in these rooms. What are the to fall that seems prominent in here? I knew there was a computer somewhere around here, so Dr. Brown. B two T F one nine five five. Let's open up this door. Whoa! So these are puzzles. I opened the last door first, so I wanted to get, do something new. So these are puzzles of some sort, I just don't know how these puzzles are supposed to be. Before I was able to click on something, but I don't see anything to click on here. Um, obviously these layers are not 
aligned correctly, so, but I don't know why it's not letting me click on anything. So, I'm gonna open up the next door. Those mouse others. Okay, those are, are, are supposed to be words, but they don't say anything. something. Okay, I think I get it now. I have to align it with that last one right there. Okay, so. Okay, so this is a puzzle of some sort. I thought it was gonna be easier than this. Oh, okay, so there's a check mark there now. Okay, so this is like this is like the previous one where there was a puzzle and all that stuff and I had to figure it out. Oh, it's one of these things. I like these. This is fun. I just have to figure out the pattern here. I'm gonna figure this thing out, I don't know what it is. That's a 
black it out or do I have to light it up? That's the question. Oh, booyah, I got it. Okay, next one. I'm so confused by that first one because of the fact that, um... It wouldn't let me click on it. That alarm will get annoying after a while. Oh, it's one of these. Okay, this was similar to one of the puzzles that I did early, uh, yesterday. Um, which is I have to align the, the colors with... their respected colors over here. It's not the one I want to do. I can't even see blue really that oh, well. I don't know what the heck's going on with it. Oh, I just messed up red. Oh, green. I messed up green somehow. Okay, what am I missing here? I'm missing something. Something is definitely wrong. Oh, there it goes, okay. Okay, cool, I got it, there we go. There's just one tile I was missing. That was weird. Okay, so that one's done. That's a really fun game, I have to say. It, it, make, it really makes you think, what is this? I'm still trying to figure out, oh. Oh. Do I have to memorize this? Oh, I have to memorize this. Oh my god, it's going to be Horrible! I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to write this stuff down because I am not gonna remember this. So it's three, three boxes, and then one, two, three, four, five, six. 
six across. No way you're gonna remember that one. Tell you what. This is the one I was, I was, I was trying to do yesterday. I was trying to figure it out, but I needed to start from. Okay, so I need to line up green. That's what I need to do. very hard to do. This one's right. No, that's not fat. So this one, that's not lining up correctly. There's no way I can move those. I need to start over because obviously I did something wrong. This may take me a while to do this one. These three cannot be moved. That is a fact. I just can't see whether or not it's turning this way or not. I 
really can't tell. Like this. It looks like it is. It's trying to... Okay, so let's go to the second floor. Harder than it looks, I'm telling you. This is not cool, bro. Oh, I got it. Sweet. I just have to do that last one. My mind is just bursting out of its skull right now. It is not cool. <laughs> They're really making me think on this one. Unlike the other one, I just had to run around and all that, but yeah, it was still a challenge. Okay, so... Oh, these things I have to touch. Oh! Okay, 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 okay. So that's the inner one. Oh, let's go back and forth, okay, so... I don't think that's right. Yeah, that's right. Last one, the top, the very top one. I can't, I can't uh, move, so I have to actually align it with that one. Okay. This one's the easiest one, I think, compared to all the other ones. Now that that's done, now what? Uh, just a reminder, Dr. Brown, your hidden experiment lies in the basement. Congratulations on being super sneaky. I thought they were, they would have caught on by now, unless they have in another reality. But that's a whole other experiment. Alrighty then. Oh. Sorry. That was just, uh... That was just a sneeze. So I have to take the elevator to the basement now. And they have elevator music. That <laughs> still trips me out. They have elevator music. Um... Negative eight. Isn't after zero the basement normally on a, on a building? There's no negatives in a building. Just how far is this basement? My god. Negative 
negative 25? What the heck? This thing's messing with my mind completely. What? Hello. Oh, now, now I'm in the basement. After all that, I finally found the basement. Yeah, this looks promising. Do I try my luck with the infinite hallway of fog, or should I just... What are these little guys? Oh, I, I'm sorry, did I interrupt you? We're gonna go for the infinite hallway. Nothing's chasing me. And it's one of these things. What? That was it? We just went down that whole elevator shaft full of ne uh, negatives and um, all that other stuff to get to the exit. Jesus, my head. Oh. What is that racket? Oh, something's changed. Something's definitely changed. My door's black. Footprints. <laughs> Hi? Who's here? Oh, there's the switch. Is there children playing? Can't go in there. What's going on here? Oh, somebody's playing a practical joke on me. Fuck is that paint on the walls? Somebody has messed with my shit. All those awards just gone right down the drain. Literally. Somebody's playing hopscotch on the roof. Hi. Damn light switch. I've always been a bit of a fan of blondes, but maybe. What is the point of this? Oh, this is not cool. I've never really had to shop for a girl before. This is kind of horrifying. Light switch is broken in this room. Rocking horse is not rocking. Oh, two guys. Easy choice. Hello? Is there somebody there? This is kind of creeping me out, actually. This is trying. This is actually starting to creep me out. <gasps> you. Oh, I hate the living daylights out of you kids.
What is this? Hold up. I have to turn it the right way. Do this to me. I can't do it. I can't turn it the right way. I can't do it. Oh, wait, 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 wait. That's been testing. I read this already. I spent all that time trying to turn it around, but I could not read that thing for the life of me. Where are the other guests? Howard's cupcake is white. Isabella's cupcake is teal. Vanilla, or no, uh, Olivia's cupcake is chocolate. Olivia, uh, Avia's ch cupcake has little teal dots on it. Emily has a flower on it. Lily has a spiral on it. Victoria has stones on it. Hmm. So, where's my cupcake? Oh, there's mine right there. <laughs> Who's that? This you isn't funny. Kids. Welcome. Those dolls are fucking creepy. You're telling me they're all staring at me! Their heads are spinning! Their heads are start turning their heads! Ah! <laughs> I hate these dolls. I hate them. So much. Can I just get a shotgun please? Can somebody give me a shotgun? Somebody give me a shotgun. Oh my god! You guys are right there. did this why 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 you have to do this to me no I don't want to I don't I don't I don't I don't can you can you guys let me go please I can't jump or anything I I, I really can't jump I can't jump at all Oh, okay, I can walk. Okay, right on top of you. Oh, thank heavens for that. What? How the? Did I just turn that off? You bitch. Turn that it's damn failed. thing off. That's right. Oh. 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 Now you're down there. I got problem solver. I'm Tired. smart. Howard? Jesus, it's 2 a.m. What the hell are you doing here? Mind if I come in first? Yeah, of course. Sorry. Come in. Let me grab you a towel and a cup of tea? Or would you prefer coffee at this time of night? Coffee, if you don't mind. Thanks. Here you go. Dry off with that. Look, tell me, what's going on? I'll give you three guesses. Ah. Butting heads with your mum and dad again? Yep. What have you done to grind their gears this time? What did I do? Jesus, you're on my case as fast as they are. Hey, hey, calm down. I was just trying to lighten the mood a little. Yeah, well, good job. Sorry. 
I'm just pissed off at them. I shouldn't be snapping at you for wanting to help. So, what's been happening? Same as usual. They want me in a shitty job and I want them to just leave me alone. I'm so tired of fighting with them. Every day they push me and I'm sick of letting them. You do know they only push you so hard because they care about you. Every time they find a job interview for you or ask you what you're doing with your life, it's because they care about you and they worry about you. If they really cared that much, then they'd listen to me when I say I don't want their help. Howard, come on. Some people don't have anyone to worry about them. You shouldn't be so quick to dismiss them. But still, I can't cope with it anymore. It's constant. I feel trapped by them. So what did happen today? I came downstairs and they were both sitting at the dinner table. It looked like Mum had been crying. They asked me to sit down and, well, they gave me one of their usual talks and things started getting worse and worse till we were in a full-on shouting match and I stormed out. I guess I could have done with it better. I know Mum was really upset, but they can just be so... Stubborn? No. Smothering. I'm happy that you feel you can talk to me when you have a problem. I'll always try to give you the best advice I can. You're a smart lad. I know that you know deep down that your parents mean well. I can relate to not wanting that pressure. I mean, Christ, look at me. I work for myself at my own pace, and I've lived my entire life trying to avoid that feeling of pressure, but well, the price I paid was a high one, one that I'm not sure was worth it. Uncle Ed? <laughs> Look, it's all right now. I'm not about to start moping around. I'm just saying that eventually you will have to make a choice. You, you can't stagnate forever. But when you do choose, it's important it's on your own terms, and, and it's one you're happy with. Your mum and dad will be fine with whatever you decide. I really do need to kick myself into gear. Come on, it's okay. So, what is it that you want to do? Well, if I knew that, then I wouldn't be here bothering you in the middle of the night. Shame you can't get paid for falling asleep? That would be my dream job. Oh, Howard, really? Well, we can't all be award-winning writers. I don't see why not. What do you mean? If you want to write for a living, then go for it. No one's stopping you but yourself. Sorry, but I don't buy that for a second. What about talent and money? Not to mention you probably need a significant amount of luck on your side, and I just don't really see myself as the lucky type. So why even bother trying? I'm not going to tell you those things aren't important, because they are. Hell, when I started, I had to hold down two jobs just to pay for the income. God knows, I had to continuously convince myself it was all worth it. I nearly gave up a hundred times, but in the end, I'm glad I stuck to it. Talent is something you can cultivate, and money, something you just need enough of to get by. And as for luck, well, money can solve that too. If you can't make a decision, flip a coin. At least that way you'll be lucky 50% of the time. Flip a coin? That's your grand advice? Hey, don't knock it. It worked for me. Yeah, I guess you worked bloody hard to get where you are. I don't really know if I'd even be any good as a writer. Besides, the world already has Edward Phillips. What would it gain with me as well? I won't be around forever. Hmm. Fascinating. So anyways, I think I'm going to end this episode here. It's turning out to be really, really interesting, the way this story is going. So um, I'm probably going to uh, continue this in the next episode because of the fact that it's pretty much a new area. So, um, but yeah, the only, this thing's pretty much right, and God knows I've actually... Um, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Um, 
I can't I can't think of the word right now. Uh, but I, I've actually done what this guy's done doing right now. Okay, it's pretty much just sitting there, not doing anything about uh, with my life really, until um, until I got up and did something about it. So I mean, right now I'm I have a good paying job and stuff like that. It works. It's working out for me. Um, and uh, and I have I have a, a hobby. I have a really good hobby that I like doing right now. And that's doing making YouTube videos for you guys. So, um, so I mean, right now it, it's it's working out until I want something more. So, uh, yeah. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this episode, please leave your likes and comments down below. And I'll see you guys next time. Later.